WB Games is comprised of several major studios who uh, have been over the last few decades building amazing experiences around really big and well-known IP around the world. Those teams depend on us to provide online services and help bring their games online and enhance those experiences. So they use our platform called Hydra. Uh, they integrate it into their games and our game teams, they get to focus on, again, building these amazing experiences that they're used to while we focus on adding, enhancing, and building the online features that allow our games to become more social and competitive and allow players to connect with each other around the world. We have currently have eight active titles live in production, the most recent of which is Mortal Kombat 11, obviously one of the most popular fighting franchises of all time. And uh, we, we use AWS to power all of our backend infrastructure. Games pose a unique situation. A lot of the game launches that we do, most especially the console game launches, there's the initial spike of the launch. So we have to basically plan for our largest day of the year, the very first day. So AWS provides a lot of tools that we take advantage of. The main primary thing that we use is EC2. We spin up hundreds of thousands of servers. We simulate all the traffic to make sure we're all set for launch day. And then we can tear those down and save costs that way too. We couldn't iterate as fast in another platform. What we're seeing as a trend wise is game servers becoming more and more of an important role in game development process. And, and based on all the functionality that we've seen in GameList so far, it's solving all of our problems. Each of the individual WB Games development teams get our full suite of online services, and then so we help them sort of pick and choose the features from our toolbox that work best to help extend their game. We're talking millions of users with hundreds of thousands of concurrent users online at the same time. The reality is, if you're gonna launch a successful video game in this, in this current world that we live in, there has to be some type of online component to it, right? Whether that's online matchmaking, playing against other players across the globe, whether that is leaderboard and stat tracking to power competitive seasons in game. Over a decade of running Hydra, we've had hundreds of millions of players around the world uh, pass through our system and record data with us and use us to connect with other players. We have seen a scale up to you know, tens of thousands of, of requests per second. Amazon also cares about our launches. They also care about our players' first day experience. A lot of what we get from AWS is that flexibility to work the way that we're comfortable working and we get time back so we can keep doing what we do best.